In the genre of movies like Flamin' Hot and The Founder, only this one is an absurd surrealist fruitcake cartoon. Unfrosted, the first movie directed by Jerry Seinfeld, who also stars in it, is an agreeably flaked out piece of surrealist vaudeville. It's a comedy about the creation of the Pop-Tart back in 1963. While broadly based in reality, the entire movie is a put-on, a wackazoid tall tale, a comedy that uses the Breakfast Wars as the jumping-off point for a high-camp exercise in nostalgic lunacy. As a kid growing up in the late 60s and 70s, I confess that I never understood Pop-Tarts. My family would buy them, and every so often I would put one in the toaster, wanting it to be a tasty treat. Such is the power of advertising that I always thought it was my fault that I found Pop-Tarts to be just okay. Prefab and a little dull, the Pop-Tart was a product of the future that seemed stuck in the past, like astronaut food. Unfrosted treats the origin story of the Pop-Tart with such a derisive backhand flippancy that it's not at all clear what Jerry and his team of screenwriter-producers actually think of the Pop-Tart. Is the movie a goof because they're making fun of what a mediocre product it was? Perhaps. Yet, if the memory of Pop-Tarts actually strikes a chord of Proustian reverence in Jerry, then why make such a misanthropic satire of it? Unfrosted, once you get onto its wavelength, passes 93 minutes in a pleasurably light and nutty way. Jerry was clearly drawn to the quaint capitalist energy of the film's essential, true story. That in the early 60s, the two reigning cereal companies in America, Kellogg's and Post, were both based in Battle Creek, Michigan, a town of 50,000, yet they were fighting like rival European fiefdoms of the 14th century. The movie is told from the point of view of Kellogg's. Seinfeld plays Bob Cabana, the company's head of development, and Jim Gaffigan is Edson Kellogg III, the head of the company. Their rival company, Post, another family dynasty run by a descendant, are the also-ran losers. If Unfrosted actually were a movie like Blackberry, it might have had a terrific resonance. But Seinfeld stages it like a dramatized series of stand-up comedy stunts. The movie is brimming with atomic age ephemera. The acting is cartoon light, agreeably broad sketch comedy mugging, which is why Jerry fits right in. Most of the jokes are LOL rather than guffaw worthy. Unfrosted is a surreal and comedic take on the creation of Pop-Tarts, offering a whimsical and nostalgic journey through the breakfast wars of the 1960s.